Um, finally, with step one, is to regenerate the quality report uh, because while uh, processing the GCP, um, the old report is outdated. So we need an update um, on the quality report. Um, to do that, we just go to process and generate quality report. Um, our I've already done that, uh, as you can see from the uh, the status bar here, uh, showing green color. So uh, just to show you how to do that through process generate quality report. Okay, now we can move on to step two, uh, point cloud and mesh. Uh, step two is relatively easy. Uh, so there are th three tabs you can see here so with point cloud so usually we go with the default on um, this half image size unless we are getting really bad result from a step one so in that case we might want to reduce the uh, um, the image size um, so to reduce that to either one fourth or one eighth depending how bad your results are okay um, we keep uh, the others are uh, just optional. Um, so if you like to export, um, you know, uh, light up points, you can check the LAS. That just takes longer time. And when you check that, you can tell that the actually the template will go from agriculture template to no template. And in the three D structure mesh, a three D texture texture mesh. Uh, uh, just suggest to keep uh, the default settings um, and in advanced also keep the default uh, default settings and just click OK and click start okay so this step may take a while um, also depending on the configuration of your computer so, so if you go to your task settings you can see that your CPU is actually 100% occupied, uh, so that means you can uh, this software can take fully advantage of your CPU. Okay. All right. 